welcome to my YouTube channel. On this channel, we talk about fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. So in today's video, I want to do a review on this Tory Burch Miller Basket Weave um, Clutch. Um, so if that's something that you're interested in hearing more about, then stay tuned. I want to thank everyone. Before I get into the video, I want to thank everyone who has so far been liking, commenting, subscribing, and telling others about my channel. Um, we are continuing to grow, and for that, I really appreciate it. I would not be where I am without your support. So I want to talk about this bag. Again, I said the brand is by Tory Burch. In one of my prior videos, I did an unboxing of the bag, and now I've since used the bag a few times, and I wanted to do a brief review to tell you about the bag, some, what I would say, a pros and cons towards the bag. You'll see me looking down because I want to make sure that I get some notes right for you. So first of all, the dimensions of the bag is 11.25 inches wide, it is 6.5 inches high, and it is 1.25 inches deep. Um, it has a front flap with magnetic closure. It has um, a front inside zipper compartment. So of course you, you can't see the zipper, well actually you could see the zipper compartment right here. I don't want the contents to fall out. It has an inside card slot. It looks like it holds about maybe three cards. Um, it's leather and it has silver hardware. I like the workmanship, um, the basket, the weaving on the front. I mean, it looks like it was good quality. Of course, it's Terry Birch, it's right, it's leather. I like the color. I like that the strap, you could take it off. So here, you could take it off and wear it as a clutch. Let me do that here. So it's a detachable, I'm not going to take off the other strap, but you can take it off, wear it as a clutch, or you could wear it as a shoulder strap. I think it's long enough too that you could also wear it as a crossbody. I've worn it as a shoulder bag, not as a crossbody yet, and not as a clutch yet, but you know, you certainly can. So the pros of the bag, I like the color, um, I like the design. I like the silver hardware. I think lots of my bags have gold hardware, so I like the silver hardware. I think the craftsmanship is pretty good. I am trying to just get the strap back on here, so that's what you see me looking like I'm struggling to do. Um, actually, we won't do that. So I like the color, like the design, like the craftsmanship. Um, I like that if I wanted to just put like cards in here and like my cell phone, I could easily do that. In this zipper compartment, I could also put a few other things. Um, I will tell you right now on Saks Fifth Avenue's website, a similar bag, it's a different colorway, it's the cornbread colorway. It retails for $528 and it's on sale for $369.60. So um, luxury, not like high-end luxury, but luxury. I bought this bag, it was on sale for a little bit less than that, so it's probably why I bought it. Um, again, it, the magnetic closure keeps things pretty secure. Um, the zipper compartment here, also if you have something that you want to keep even more secure, you could do that there. Now I would say, honestly, my only drawback to the bag is that you can't hold a lot. Um, when I bought the bag, initially I thought I could use it interchangeably with other bags for work. And I would say, um, I can, but you just can't put a lot. So if you really, if you're the kind of person, you take a lot of things to work, you take a lot of things with you this is probably not the bag for you but if that's not an issue for you then this is certainly a bag that you could um, use we have um, a, like a coin purse that has a card slot you saw me talk about this already in a prior video I like this because I could easily instead of taking a big wallet I could just take this with cards and coins um, a big wallet that I have I have a big macro course wallet that will not fit in this bag so this is by coach this easily fits I also have a compact soap powder that fits a pen a pen <laughs> some perfume a little perfume sample and some hand sanitizer and if you wanted to put cards directly in the bag you could do that but um, but I mean honestly you can't really put a lot in this bag so I think this bag is really good for like a date night if you're going out out on the town you've heard me talk about that before 
um, I mean, probably even if you go to the mall, you'll see, I'll insert a picture of um, when I did wear the bag casually. This bag, I think, works, it dresses up an outfit, but even if you're wearing something casual as I have in the picture that I'm showing, you can see that it still, like, it still goes with the outfit. It doesn't look, like, out of place or anything, but I think my, um, probably one of the reasons why this bag would not get maybe as much use as some other bags is because it's a little bit, I think, on the small side in terms of the content that it could hold. Of course, I should be mindful not to take too many things anyway, but if you're like me and you sometimes carry a lot of things day to day, then this is probably not a good day to day bag. Um, again, I like that you can wear it as a clutch, but because it is small in terms of the capacity on the inside, it probably won't get as much use. So this is going to be just a short video just to give you a review on the bag. I did an unboxing and whenever I do an unboxing of a bag, I, I will tell you, I will wear it for a little bit and then do a subsequent video on what I think about the bag. So again, you can check out the prior video or one of the prior videos where I talked about this, I think in my handbag collection, one of those videos, prior early on videos. Um, I like the bag. Um, I love the design. You can see here it has a Tory Burch emblem the silver hardware there um, in the front and on the side and um, yeah so I hope you enjoy this is gonna be a really short video I know several of my videos have been on the longest side so I wanted to do something that was a little bit short um, still in the realm of fashion because that's mostly what we'll be talking about on this channel um, stay tuned for some upcoming videos because I'm gonna do some fashion but do something a little bit different so um, Feel free to continue to tell your friends and family about the video, like, comment, subscribe, turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss when I post my next video. And actually in terms of today's outfit, my outfit of the day, my outfit beat, um, I have on a dress by White House Black Market and my lipstick is by MAC and actually let me see, I forgot the name of the color, it's Pure Heron. It's sort of like a shimmery um, lipstick, I tend to rather matte lipsticks because then I don't have as much issues with um, lipstick color not going where it's supposed to but anyway so that's my outfit um, I hope you enjoyed this video it was a short one which I'm sure you appreciate thanks I hope you're doing well bye